All right, here I am in Immersed, in the Immersed Void. I was going to do a little uh, video today for um, an environment exploration. So I'm going to pull up the main menu, and today we're going to check out the Orbitarium. So I'm going to go ahead and, I think that's how you pronounce it, Orbitarium. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and open up that, and so here I am in the environment. I'll go ahead and hide my screens so you can't see them. And if I look around, you can see that this environment is really oriented towards someone giving presentations. Uh, and you can tell that because I'm standing in this sort of stage or dais or dais or however you say that. And if I look at what uh, positions are available, there's a lot of seats in the room, so to speak. Um, so I like sitting over here um, on the side because you can see this grand view of the planet orbiting below, or I guess we're orbiting the planet and the stars. Let me disable my hands there. Um, and you can see this is just sort of like a modern, sleek-looking room. There's a clock up there, and you, I can imagine sitting here and watching and listening to somebody make a presentation, um, and that would be pretty neat. Um, so you can, um, you can work from here, and this is a good spot to work from. Well, of course, you can work from anywhere in here, but in this spot, you know, I've got screen. In this case, I have three screens. I could have up to five or just one or whatever, but you can still get the ambiance of the, of the planet and the, you know, the stars and all that. Um, or um, you could actually, I mean, you could go to, um, let me hide my screens again. Um, you could go uh, back up on to the dais here. There we go, on the stage and show your screens from here and you could work in this area but if you know from this spot you know your background is just a room uh, you know you can't see the fun stuff so what I actually like to do if I spend the whole day in this environment is I like to go to the very top very center here and work from here because this is a, this is a really fun spot to uh, to to work from, and uh, the neat part about this uh, spot is that you have this grand view, um, and you're also kind of up high. Uh, you know, you got a nice high ceiling, but we're not on the floor; we're sort of in the middle, so you can have some pretty giant screens here. Um, so, what I might do if I was starting the day to work here. Also, one one item of note: if um, if I look at my settings for audio, my ambiance vol volume is turned up. But I don't hear anything. That's because this particular environment doesn't have any any uh, ambiance sound. So I like to, you know, since I'm in space, um, it's kind of fun to go over and how about the background noise for Star Trek, the Enterprise. There we go. So you got some hum of the engines. You got some little beeps and you know sounds to give you give you that effect here, um, which is kind of fun. But then also. Being in here, I, I really can maximize. Oops, um, I can maximize the screen, the, the screen real estate. So what I will do when I'm in here all day is, let me kind of move these screens out of the way. I'll take this guy and push him way back and down, and then just go grab this corner and go. <laughs> and how about that for a large? screen so I usually sort of fine-tune it to get really big and sort of really maximize the space just until things start getting cut off I'm a little cut off up there you know you get the idea somewhere right in there somewhere like like that and then um, I'll actually go one step further and um, got, oops there's a picture of my son there um, actually go ahead and on the display um, I'll just play with the scaling and kind of scale that down so I, in this case I'm getting you know uh, 2496 by 1664 as far as pixel density so what that does is you can see that gives me a lot of screen real estate a lot of times I'll do a um, you know something where I've got um, uh, you know the, the one screen on on the side of the screen over here and then I'll do another screen 
you know, over here. And that gives me a lot more, I'm a software developer, so it gives me a lot more code to work with. And then usually I will kind of make these side screens pretty giant too, and kind of usually curve those around, something like this. Kind of make this guy a little bigger. And like that, something like that. That's looking pretty good. And then, um, a lot of times what I like to do, because I still have a lot of area here in front of me, is go ahead and enable another another screen. So let me do that here. So I get all my screens to re-render. There they come. And then here's my new screen. I'll grab it, unpin it, and a lot of times what I'll do, let me bring that to the front. Kind of make it, I like it uh, flat for this. And then I have the auto rotate turned off so I can sort of angle it like this right here in front of me. So now if I repin everything, there we go. So now I've got, you see my wife over there. Um, I have all these di the different screens um, here and um, I can you know, put usually I'll put a database over there. I put code in the middle. Usually communications panel down here, like Slack or something. Um, and then the app I'm working on will be over there. I don't need to rejuggle all my screens right at the moment, but you get the idea. So um, this is a fun way for me, I think, to work because I'm right in the middle sight line of this giant monitor with lots of screen real estate. I've got my side monitors on the left to the right. I've got my communication panel down low. I can usually sometimes put some music on over the top of that ambient uh, sound. And there you go. This is a great, great place to work. I've, I've worked like whole weeks at a time in this one environment. Um, you know, and then sometimes you can literally just just hide your screens and take, take, take a deep breath and just, wow, look at this environment. So it's really fun. And once again, uh, I have never been in a meeting in here, but I think that would be really fun. Some sort of somebody presenting down there and sharing their screen and everything. But uh, but that's basically it. The Orbitarium, my, my two personal favorites are this top center spot. And then over there on the right uh, is neat because I can get the kind of have the, uh, the planet in the background. Um, and this is a fun one of many, many, many environments in Immersed. And it's a fun way to spend your workday. So that's an exploration of the Orbitarium environment.